I focus on everything that has a lot to do with airway. From what I'm finding in dentistry, airway is the foundation and causal factor for a lot of symptoms and pain. I started first uh, years ago looking at cosmetics in dentistry. But if you just look at cosmetics, you find out that there's a lot of the gearing or the, how the way the teeth function. So then you have to look at the jaw and how the jaw joints work and how there's overall muscle function. But then you find out behind that is an airway issue. That's the underlying problem in all of dentistry and most of all for physicians' cases with ear, nose, and throat. And if you can address how the jaw functions within the airway system, you make sure the nose is working as well, then you're gonna solve a lot of those problems. And that's why I got into taking care of people with apnea because it, it all kind of intertwines with jaw function, cosmetics. And if you go even further back, you can look at the kids. And if their growth and development aren't where they're supposed to be, you can try to put out the fires early on and then these adults wouldn't have these issues. I'm trying to find um, causal factors. I'm not just trying to put a Band-Aid on something. What differentiates uh, Chicago ENT in my mind from a dental perspective is that they are very open to oral appliances as an alternative to CPAP, really looking at uh, other ways to take care of their patient when people are intolerable of the CPAP devices or they want to carry their CPAP device, we're able to give them an alternative. And that alternative is an oral sleep appliance. The oral device that we work with has a, a lower component and an upper component, fit specifically and very precisely to the teeth, and they help provide a little bit of a protrusive movement for the lower jaw to help open the airway with the tongue and uh, oral structures and soft tissues of the neck. When I'm taking care of patients at Chicago ENT, I really want to take care of them as if I was a patient. I want to be, if I was a patient, treated with uh, respect. I want to be treated on time, get people in and out when they are scheduled, and make sure that their concerns are addressed. If they have questions, I want to spend the time to answer them for them. What I enjoy most about this practice is when I see people come back after two to three years and they say, everything's been great. We haven't had to change anything too much. Uh, there haven't been a lot of issues. We're seeing that they're getting a lot of results.